When Aegon the Conqueror invaded Westeros, he had seven kingdoms to contend with. The Kingdom of the North, the Kingdom of the Mountain and the Vale, the Iron Islands, the Kingdom of the Rock, the Kingdom of the Reach, the Stormlands, and Dawn. These regions had been established by the first men thousands of years before, in the Age of Heroes. One hero of this fabled age was Bran the Builder. Bran raised the wall and built the stronghold of Winterfell, establishing House Stark and reigning as the first king in the north. Other legends tell of the Grey King in the Iron Islands. The Grey King took a mermaid to wife and defeated Naga, the first sea dragon. House Greyjoy of Pike, the current rulers of the region, claimed to descend from him. House Casterly ruled the gold-rich Westerlands from their mighty seat of Casterly Rock but their lands and power were swindled from them by the legendary trickster, Lan the Clever. The noble house of Lannister is said to have descended from him. The verdant and fertile lands of the Reach were first ruled by House Gardener, whose founder, known as Garth Greenhand, wore a crown of flowers and vines. He ruled from Highgarden as the first king of the Reach and was said to have made the land bloom. Many noble houses trace their bloodlines back to him, including the current lords of Highgarden, House Tyrrell. In the Stormlands, according to Ballads of the Age, a warrior named Durin fell in love with Elenai, whose father was god of the sea and mother was goddess of the wind. She gave her maidenhead to him, committing herself to a mortal life. Enraged, her parents called upon the winds and waters destroying Darren's bayside keep and wiping out his wedding guests. Darren declared war on the gods and rebuilt his keep, which was also destroyed. Four more castles he raised, each stronger than the last. All fell to the power of the gods. But Darren's seventh castle, Storm's End, withstood the gods' rage. Darren became known as Darren God's Grief and reigned as the first Storm King. There are countless other tales from the Age of Heroes, too many to count. These histories weren't recorded in a book, but passed down from generation to generation through story and song. And while some of them may be dismissed as fairy tales, every one of the Seven Kingdoms is defined by them. <laughs>